Well, we told you last week about traffic backups at the state-run COVID-19 vaccination site at the University Mall. We're watching to see if this is an issue once again today. Local and state leaders are aware of the problems. They're working right now to find some type of solution. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Mazella is there live now with a relief this could provide to businesses feeling the impact. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, Dia. And yeah, we've been reporting on all of the traffic backups here at the University Mall vaccination site since last week. And we also spoke with many of you who were out here waiting hours to get vaccinated. They called us yesterday and then told us that uh, to be here at uh, 1030 or not to 1015, no later, no sooner. And uh, we got into this and we've been here five hours. The backups leading to traffic spilling out onto the very busy Fowler Avenue. I would have stayed home had I known we were going to have to go through this mess. Tampa City Councilman Luis Vieira now says he's seen firsthand just how hard it is for customers to get in and out of the surrounding businesses. These businesses have taken hit after hit after hit. Now Vieira, along with Representative Fentrice Driscoll and Hillsborough County Commissioner Gwen Myers, are all working together to get better traffic assistance in this area. We just want to make sure that the surrounding businesses that have already taken so many hits over the last year due to COVID-19 are not overly adversely affected um, due to this vaccination site being there. State and local leaders say they are still working with different departments to see what help may be available and we're continuing to press them for a timeline. And also uh, something interesting, there were hardly any people out here yesterday. There were really no lines out here at the University Mall vaccination site, but that could be because it was President's Day yesterday. But today the site opens up again at 8 and we will continue to monitor any potential crowds. We're live this morning in Tampa. Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.